The man who says he used a crossbow to shoot his victim in a sexually motivated murder received a 36-year prison sentence today. Nicole Strandberg tortured 22-year-old Jennifer Bergeron to death back in 2008. KXY 4's Jeff Humphrey was in Superior Court today when Bergeron's mother faced her daughter's killer. Nicole Strandberg was let into court today under extra heavy security. The man who's fought with corrections deputies five different times was chained to a desk and couldn't escape the wrath of the victim's mother. I don't know if you understand what your actions have done to our family, Cole. You have taken a life in the most cruel and gruesome way. There will forever be a hole in my heart that will never be filled. Back in January of 2008, Strandberg befriended Jennifer Bergeron at the STA bus plaza and invited her to his apartment. Inside, police say Strandberg used a variety of tools to torture the young woman, including shooting her in the head with a crossbow. I wish that there truly could be justice done and that she would have to endure exactly what you did to her. The only reason I can sleep at night is because you can't do this to any other young woman again. While Strandberg admits killing Bergeron, both the prosecution and defense blame Spokane mental health officials for not acting on a report from Strandberg's caseworker that he was threatening to shoot someone. They had a warning that Mr. Strandberg was threatening to shoot people with a crossbow. And they had a counselor who reported this through the correct channels to see to it that that threat was addressed. Even the judge agreed Strandberg's mental health problems had not been properly handled both before and after his arrest and then sentenced Strandberg to 36 years behind bars for the sexually motivated death of Jennifer Bergeron. He's going to be locked up so he can't hurt anybody else and I think this it's a win-win honestly. I think she would have been happy. The jail staff is also happy with today's sentencing. Strandberg has been locked up here for more than three years and can't even be out of his cell without more than four deputies present. Now within the week, Strandberg will become the Department of Corrections problem at least for the next 36 years. Reporting at Superior Court, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.